Okay, hey guys, this is an example of a basic redox reaction. And so let's start off with the first step that I showed you in the um, last video. And the first step was to um, take the charges of each element. And actually, I should have said ions because here, cyanide is not an element, it's an ion. So let's take the charge of that because it'll work the same way. And so we get negative 1 because of that. And then this is x minus 8 equals negative 1. So this is a plus 7. And this is x minus 1 equals negative 1. And so this is a plus 1. And this is a plus 4. Um, next step is to split it into half reactions. <coughs> so we get cyanide producing CnO minus okay and this one has a negative one charge and this cyanide has a plus one charge let's add two electrons and now the next step is to balance the charges of the whole sides and this one this side has a negative one charge and this side has a negative one negative two negative three because of the two electrons and so let's add two hydrogen ions. Okay? Now let's balance the hydrogens and the oxygens. And there's one oxygen and two hydrogens, so there must be one water. Okay. So now we have a balanced acidic reaction. We just balanced this for an acidic reaction. And it's actually a basic reaction, right? So we add hydroxide ions to cancel out the hydrogen ions because if we add those together the negative and the positive turn into zero right there's a negative one and positive one and then these would combine to form water okay and uh, the reason why we're canceling canceling out the hydrogen ions is because um, generally, we can't find hydrogen ions in basic solutions. <coughs> and so, we have to cancel them out. And let's use the hydroxide ions. Let's um, replace the two hydrogen ions with two waters, because we added two hydroxide ions on this side. And because we added it... Oh, sorry. <coughs> excuse me because we added two hydroxide ions to this side we have to do the same to the other side let's add two hydroxide ions Oops. okay and so do you have this um, half reaction balanced no because now the problem is that we have waters on this side and waters on this side and so basically we can simplify it because one water will go to one water so we don't really have to put that down so let's erase the two and let's erase the water okay next so yeah we have this half reaction balanced now the next step is to um, balance the manganese okay so we have MnO4 minus producing MnO2. And first step is there's one Mn on each side. We're balanced. Now the charges, there's a plus 7 for this side and a plus 4. So let's add 3 electrons. <coughs> okay, we're done with that. And now let's add, um, so there's 4 negative 4 and there's 0 on this side so let's add 4 hydrogen ions and then there's 4 um, hydrogens and 4 oxygens so let's add 2 waters okay and so there's 4 hydrogens and 4 oxygens and then the next step is to cancel out the hydro hydrogen ions with hydroxides and so, let's add 
four hydroxides to cancel out the hydrogens. Let's do okay, 4H2O. I don't know if you can see that. Oh, okay. So four waters, and then let's add four hydroxides to this side also. Oops. Okay. So we cancel out the waters next. So we get two waters here and none here. So let's put this closer here. Okay. And now we have to add. And we can't add because the electrons don't can wouldn't cancel each other out. They have to. So let's multiply this whole side here. Here. Let's multiply this whole side. Oops. By three so that the electrons can cancel. And then this whole side by two. Okay? And that will turn the electrons into six electrons. So multiplying this by three we get three hydroxides with uh, oh sorry six hydroxides with three cyanides and three CNO minus and six electrons and three waters okay and for this half reaction we get four <coughs> waters <coughs> and six electrons and two MnO four minus producing two MnO two and eight hydroxide ions. Okay. And so we can cancel out the electrons now. Let's do that right now. There's six electrons on this side and six electrons on this side. Okay? So they're cancelled out. Now let's cancel out the hydroxides. And there's six hydroxides on that side and six hydroxides on that side. Or eight. Sorry. So we can cancel out this um, six hydroxides. And so we get two hydroxides. Um, for, for water... There's three here and four here, so let's do actually H two. Oh, there we go. Now we just add through, and we can get the balanced chemical equation, which is one water and three cyanides um, reacting with two. MnO4 minus producing um, 3CnO minus and 2MnO2 plus 2OH minus. And this whole thing is our balanced basic redox reactions. Thank you for watching, um, comment and rate, uh, bye.